Hey guys, DK Web Design Studio back again for another exciting episode. Today we're going to be going over something pretty simple to execute, but extremely effective, especially when you're trying to engage an audience and, and have members-only content available for your site visitors. So we're going to be using the tool that Wix has called the Members Site tool. And to implement a members only site, all you have to do is click on the add button on the sidebar menu, navigate down to where it says members near the bottom, and we're gonna click add to site. Wix is gonna do some magical additions where we don't even have to really do anything. It's setting up the entire account page, modifying all of the fonts to match your existing themes, uh, setting up all the colors to match your themes. And so everything's gonna be beautifully set up and I didn't really have to do much of anything other than click one button. Now that the members site is here, you'll notice near the top of the page, you have a login bar. That login bar is <clears throat> can, can be set up to show a number of different things. Um, you can have a profile pick and a dropdown or a profile pick and the member's name show up or any variation thereof. So I can just have the name or just keep it default. Now, this members um, dropdown, I can arrange wherever I want. By default, it'll end up somewhere in your header. So you might want to rearrange its positioning. Um, you can also change the size of this icon so that it is a little bit more con compact and might fit better in your website. And I'm just going to line it up near the top here where I have my social media icons. This is a strip near the top and I'm just putting it on that strip and fixing the alignment to match the social bar. Um, and I can click preview and you can see the drop down uh, once I preview the site. There it is. All right. So now that I have a member's site set up on my uh, page, <clears throat> what I can do and by default, Notice how Wix navigated to the members account page. I can go back to the home page, so I don't have to start off in the my account view. But from my account, we can achieve a number of pretty cool things. So I can add pages now to my website, to my members uh, site, and only have members access to those pages. So I'm gonna click add a new page, and we're gonna call this something new here let's uh let's click on seo and we're going to change the name of the page we'll call it uh free pdf all right so maybe we'll want to have a download on this page only for members and they can only members can access this free download um let's go back to page info see if we can modify the name free pdf all right there's the name changed go back and you'll notice from the login bar, once the member is logged in, they'll have access to that page now. And I'll show you an example if we click preview. Um, sorry, let's go back here. Let's make sure we've enabled the preview ability. Settings and uh, hide from login bar. So we wanna show it in the login bar. So I didn't see that that was set up. All right, and now when I click preview, you can see the login bar is going to have that page for PDF. So we want it there, or we can hide it just like you saw what was feasible. On this page, if we want to embed a PDF file, all we have to do is create some cool text, some ca catchy text up here, and we can say, download your free PDF here. We're gonna make this text into a link. Now you can of course have a button, or if you look at one of my other videos, you can see where you can actually embed an icon that links to the PDF or directly is the PDF once they click on it. But text is gonna suit me for now. I'm gonna click link. And instead of a normal web page type link, we're gonna to go to a document. And we're gonna choose a file um, just by clicking here. And we have a couple of cool examples. I'm just gonna click add to page and click done. Now, we might wanna just make that stand out with a blue color. Um, if you don't have a color here, we can pick from the color wheel. We go straight up blue like that, that looks cool. Oops, forgot to click add. Click 
add and now we have a new color down here we'll just click on that click away and now we have a members only free PDF and we're gonna go and manage the page again we're gonna check the settings one more time um, always helpful to go through this entire process make sure you're happy with how everything's set up the URL of the page is named correctly your your SEO so how how the page shows up in Google as you can see because it's a members page it doesn't show up in Google um, <clears throat> so just be aware of that but you will see a option to modify the page URL uh, permissions you got English who can view the page and right now this is restricted only to members um, we can modify our member settings by clicking that link below member signup settings and here we can choose we can designate everyone to be a member or only people that you can approve so this is helpful if you see a bunch of spam coming in and or somebody makes up a fake uh, email address and um, they're not verified properly or you just don't want somebody to be a member you can alternate and you can select who gets to membership to your site or not um, and then of course new member sign up versus existing so this is the login page when somebody clicks that's not currently a member on you know sign in or log in they're going to show up to either the first page which would be a new member sign up form or once you have enough members like maybe 50 to 100 you might want to alternate it and let those members sign in quicker by not having to navigate to a log me in option um, if they're an existing member already um, now if somebody logs in and becomes a member and they don't clear their cash of course they're going to be a member as soon as they log in back to the site they're going to log in automatically but if they haven't cleared their cash um, then they're they're going to end up um, if they have cleared their cash rather they're going to end up having to you know navigate to the log me in page instead of a sign up form so hopefully i didn't confuse you too much and i can show you exactly what i mean um, once i publish this so i'm going to click publish view site and as you can see i'm not logged in so I have to click login and it's going to ask me to sign up because if you recall the setting was on sign up page first rather than the login page which would be this one enables faster faster login. So I'm just going to log in so I can demonstrate what we just achieved. Now that I'm logged in I have access to the free PDF and I'm going to click here. And notice you can also toggle or designate in your menu whether or not a members only page shows up. If you do show it up in your menu, when somebody clicks on it, it's going to ask them to log into the account if they're not already a member. So it's another cool way to entice your visitors to join the site. Now from the free PDFs page, I can click download your free PDF and voila, there you have it. Hopefully this was helpful, guys. Uh, you can do many variations of this. Set up automatic emails, autoresponders, uh, promotional campaigns, you name it, and enable members-only PDF downloads through Wix's super simple interface. All right, guys. Thanks so much. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you guys on the next time.